second match because whatever whatever happens here is it's going to set up everything else that happens basically the rest of the tournament. Yes. Yeah, so uh, we were uh, Bloodhawk and I were discussing this uh, a little bit earlier on what the approach to GM is, and in this game Lee has a bunch of tools that really sort of covered up his weaknesses in the previous game. Uh, before the idea was to outrange uh, GM, which Bloodhawk is very good at with Leo's down forward too. But um, in this game, with Crouch Dash mix up and an assortment of, of uh, moves that allow Lee to come in close up forward three, it's a different it's a different ball game. Yeah. The frames off of up forward three. Oh, he pulls out the violet. Oh, he's got Lee Violet. Now oh. this is his main team now. All right, so. Character knowledge has been GM's weaknesses in the past, yes. and Marduk is relatively new, new to GM. Yes. Ooh, I'm excited. Yeah, I'm, this is going to be excited. This is it, it's going to be how GM reacts to what's going on with the characters. Now and, he knows Leo very well, and I will say that Bloodhawk has advantage momentum-wise coming in, coming into this. He's been playing well today. Yeah. Oh, a great reaction time sidestep hop kick. GM classic. Good wall damage. He and, finished it. And Bloodhawk uh, protects his red light. Marduk can reversal that if he chooses to delay. It's a tough technique, but it is, it is an interesting approach. Oh, and with that. Or Bloodhawk gets the, the wall splat. Oh, hey there, where are you going? Ooh. Oh, stomps in the head. Stomp. Oh, great sidestep. Side step Awkward wall angle, good break. And tackle. Oh, oh, that could be some blood in the water if GM can't be consistent with tackle breaks. Ooh, he gets slow juggled on. Missed input yeah. by, by, by uh, Bloodhawk by going for a Brian H of jumping straight in the air and, and going a for a mix up. <laughs> Oh, you gotta face. Yeah, you gotta respect them poking frames. But one of Marduk's major weaknesses is the inability to get in close and poke the other person, which Lee excels at. So really, Bloodhawk might want to focus on staying out of range of Lee. But Lee's just gonna come at you with misstep. Gotta yep. keep him out. There we go. Ooh. Saw an opportunity and took it. Right between the May not have. Hey! Bloodhawk takes his hand off the stick. GM takes his hand off the stick. Oh no, it could have been that GM's controller. Oh, it might have been GM's controller. You know that issue when the the cable yeah, is the in cable, too long? Yeah, the cable, yeah. it could be GM. GM has to go to wireless. Yeah, GM has to go to wireless. All right, this is sort of a, a glitch with Tekken. Once your controller reaches full battery, it loses sync with, with the game. And uh, this was true in six, and this is true in this game. I don't know if it's true in other games. It, ooh, swapping out a stick? Oh, it's Bloodhawk stick. I am being informed it was Blo Bloodhawk is bringing out a new stick. This is very bad. You yes. never want to change sticks. No, not in the middle of a no, not, not in the middle, middle of a match. on stage no. at a major. Oh no. Okay, right now, right now, Bloodhawk's got to collect himself, take a breather. Go outside, <laughs> drink some lemonade, come back in, and then finish up finals. Unless they choose to reset it. Oh, no, they're continuing. Oh, oh, no. Nope. Bloodhawk gets the wake up. Got to use this momentum now to get back in the groove. Oh. Now, was, did did they a, play out that round, or did they? I think they played out that round, yeah. yeah. They have played out that round. All right, so hopefully, oh, you got to respect Leo's while standing there. That is a mean launcher. You can't even see her behind him. You see that? She was just a shadow behind the big dude. Yeah, which can be used for a throw mix-up. Yeah. Lee coming back. Good Breaking break. throws. Marduk. That is, okay, so far uh, GM has tried that uh, running knee twice now, and it has resulted in damage for him. Bloodhawk a little bit better at the range zero guessing game so far. That's GM funny. better at the sidestep hop kick and poking game. Ooh. Ooh. This is going to hurt. Both of these characters do a lot of damage against the wall. A lot. And let's say GM loses this match. 
I think he may switch to Lars uh, to Lee uh, Lars. Lee Lars, yes. We have been seeing that from GM uh, in this tournament a little bit when he's been pressured, but his uh, his Lars is uh, it's a Lars. Yeah, I mean it's uh, you know it's a Lars. Everyone has a pocket Lars. I don't have a pocket Lars. Uh, you should. He's on sale this week. You might want to get. Ooh, one. I like sales. <laughs> and ground throw. Ooh, he read that perfectly. Yeah. That was a very telegraphed ground throw, which GM noticed and used as an opportunity oh, to attack in. Oh, he misses a juggle. Oh, but apparently on Marduk it hits. Ah, 12 frame punish. Isn't Leo's a forward 1-2-12 in this game? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and Marduk. Oh, he oh. misses it. Well, he's protecting his life. Oh, bad time to roll. Eight for a classic bait. And Marduk's Safe. got a, oh, see that, that getting in close to Marduk. Oh, the Hogan drop. <laughs> tackle. <laughs> and he broke tackle. That was a good, oh, and he read the low. Never end a match with the low. Hulk, Hulk's excited right now. The yeah. GM GM's Hulk's demon. Bronson rule number 26. Never, Never end the match with the low. Now Unless you're Bronson Tran in its finals, now then let's go see low. If, if he switches. Let's but see the rule is never go low. That is a scrub maneuver, but yep. and, and right on cue, GM which is the characters. GM was uh, hoping that the down back three, that the delay in time for the move to come out would have saved him, but uh, no. Bloodhawk on top of that parry, up 1-0 in games. This is a good move from GM. You've got to stay off the. Sometimes when you have clone characters, you use the same strategy. Yeah, you get too used to those characters, and you lose confidence when yeah. one when, when one falters. Because sometimes it's just a bad day. Yep. Uh, clone characters could bring out the strength as a player, but it could also bring out your biggest weaknesses as a player. Yeah, as well. this game is favoring a lot of the uh, the hop kick characters, uh, which Lee can do, blazing kick and whatnot. Yeah. But uh, not GM's playstyle. Not a not a Tekken Six sort of playstyle. GM keeping him at the wall with poking. Ooh, good oh, good counter hit down back too. This is the jungle. Leo's got uh, rage. You know, he's got to watch out. Quarter circle forward two. Oh, we got to check that. Oh, he tags out with it. Tags out. That is that is an appropriate appropriate maneuver. Kudos to GM. Lars, another one of those characters with a large array of counter hit launchers that approach from distance, very similar to Bob. Lars is very much made for this game. A lot of his taggable launchers, a lot of his uh, strings that are good TA launchers. Ooh. And, and can do damage on Netsu. Yep. But it's it's really his lows that are his weakness. If you can just stay up and eat the lows except the readable ones, then you're in good shape against Lars. And if your throw break by GM, breaking a two throw. But you're not going to get around him, which doesn't matter anyway if you're Marduk. Ooh, and a stomp. Oh, oh wow. read that tackle. Oh, if that were Funny Kid, he would have, uh, oh, a cross-up. Yep, nice little sandwich seen, juggle. Yeah, sandwich juggle. Not so common, but. Ooh, oh, counter hit down back two. Read the fancy pants and gotta missing get that. Got to get Marduk out of there. Got to get Marduk out of there. And right on cue, he loses. <laughs> well, loses around. I mean, sometimes you got to stay in. Sometimes you just got to got to man up, stay in, and uh, throw out hop kick. The down forward one yeah, for poking game, some jabs. Lars showing him off his his poking ability, which is good. Ooh. Oh, oh, that was a very raw tag in. Comes that in was with raw. Glass and gets that was a bloody ball. tag in. That's what that was. So raw. Oh, look at all that red life that Marduk loses as a result. And Lee, oh, Lee get him out. looking to just solid out the win. 40 seconds left on the clock. Wow. And he hits an orbital heel. Wow. Out of nowhere, too. You uh, can, can see the Bloodhawk was, disapp was disappointed because it came out of nowhere. Now, Bloodhawk should wait a little bit here. Just chill. And he is. Yeah. He's holding his head back. Smart tournament player. Yeah. So, Lars. Lars is opening up the opportunity for Lee to play a certain way. Yep. And not, not depending on just one character strategy and being able to do that. Yeah. Well. So, if you're on even health with Lee, he's got to come in. And coming in with Lee is the dangerous part. 
uh, especially against Marduk. Marduk is really getting a lot of those those meaty, meaty down hits. back twos. Yep, a lot of those counter hits. So Lars is offering the opportunity for uh, to get ahead in life so that the other character has to come into Lee, where Lee excels. Very good, tied 1-1, one, one. third game. Loser goes home. Well, they don't oh. have to leave right away, but you know. <laughs> They're out of the tournament. You know, stick around. Yeah, stick around and watch the rest of the yeah, tournament. Yeah, sure. I mean, you're here. What are you going to do? Take Mega Bus? Yeah. Marduk has no keep outs, too, basically. No, he's not really a keep out character. You just got to gotta play the rock, paper, scissor game. And GM without the break, but the wall is going to play a role here. Oh, yeah. That was a good try with, uh, with the ground throw. Good. Oh, good, good just frame. Well, it's not quite a just frame. Gets the side throw with Leo. Building back red life with Marduk. Maybe to look at... Ooh, oh, splash. Delay bait. That was dangerous, but it paid off. Oh, the raw tag came out of nowhere. Raw get him tag, out. get him out. All right, so... Wow, the YOLO of Neo Exu. Oh, oh, this is the last part of the tag. Oh, okay. Wow. Wow, that was exactly like Neo X. <laughs> that was... <laughs> That right was the Neo X. And that kind of stuff, can, this might actually change the whole, change the yeah, whole momentum it, for the match now. Because when you think you win and you lose, that's the worst feeling that ever. That is the worst feeling ever. Oh, the crowd's starting to get on, fan, or on Bloodhawk's side. GM not the crowd favorite. Sidewalking oh, left. Sudden hop kick the, with the hope kick. Oh, he misses the juggle. GM might be falling apart a little bit here. The just frame. Let's see if he finishes off. Oh, uh, momentum switching. He misses it. Sometimes that's e that's hard. To, that's easy to miss on that side, depending on. A that's why you got to do juggles that work 99% of the time. And attempts the hope kick. Bloodhawk 2-0 in rounds. Oh, the high crush. Games. He's saving that. Saving that. Notice the GM was going highs. Ooh, we did that tagging. It's lucky that he didn't get blocked. That would have been. You would have got launched for that. The last round when you save all of the tactics that your opponent, all of the weaknesses, you save it for the last round. But Bloodhawk may have played his ace in the hole. Yep. Now the moment is swinging again. Well, we've seen that before in, in this. Ooh, oh, get up kick into a juggle. Get up kick's very strong in this game. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Ooh, oh, the wall slide just might be in. it. Oh, he was expecting Leo to tag in to protect the red life. Oh, yo, oh, and the raw oh, tag goes break. unpunished. Goes unpunished. I, I think Marduk does that in order to protect Ooh, the hop kick. Oh, lost GM punished. coming back, possibly. Oh, nope. Oh, oh the tag crash. Oh, oh hop kick. kick. Bloodhawk has defeated his Blood demon. Bloodhawk has defeated his demon. An excessive amount of hop kicks is really what did GM in. Yeah. After that, and then the, the, the crazy part is after he's changed the stick and started, you know, and help them out during the match. Usually I, that's I, usually the kiss of death when you have to change.